Would you like to learn how to get better results from your digital marketing campaigns in 2022? If so, stick around because in today's episode, I'm going to show you five things you can do to get better results from your digital campaigns. Here are the five tips we'll discuss today. Testing your way to success, getting expert help, engagement rates versus click-through rates, chatbots, and generating quick revenue for your business. My name is Jamie Turner. You may have read one of my books or seen me on TV, but the number one thing I love to do is to help people like you grow their business and improve their lives. Digital marketing includes email marketing, banner ads, paid search, organic social media, chatbots, and just about anything else that uses the internet to drive leads to your business. Tip number one, test your way to success. If you track and measure the results of your campaigns, then you should take the next step forward and run A-B split tests. An A-B test is where you test a single variable on one of your campaigns to see if you can improve the results. If you test a blue subscribe now button against a red subscribe now button and find that the blue one generated 5% more clicks, that's great. That result is now called your control, and your goal in future campaigns is to see if you can beat the control. For example, does a green button convert better than the blue button? Spoiler alert, everybody hates the color green, so don't test green. I'm kidding, green, just relax, it was a joke. Some colors are so sensitive. Tip number two, don't be afraid to ask for help. A lot of things I'm talking about can be done yourself. But what if you're wall-to-wall -wall busy or don't have the time to do these things? Or what if you're not a digital marketing expert and just don't know how to get this stuff done? Well, I'm about to give you the biggest tip of all, which is to go to Marketer Hire to bring the freelance experts in you need to get the work done. Marketer Hire, which is the sponsor of this video, is a great resource for for anyone who's too busy or wants to hire an expert to do some of the work for you. Need someone to handle your content marketing? Boom, it's done. Need someone to do a paid search campaign? Nailed it. SEO? Yowza. Email marketing? Heck yeah. You can even hire a fractional CMO to take marketing strategy and direction off your hands. You know one of the best parts about all of this? When you hire an expert, they free you up to focus on the stuff you need to work on. And getting started is super easy. First of all, schedule an appointment with Marketer Hire. After you discuss your needs, you'll be matched with a freelancer in as little as 48 hours. From there, you'll kick off the project and get started right away. And Marketer Hire checks in every two weeks to make sure your projects are on track. So out of all the tips about digital marketing in this video, the most important one might be to hire an expert to get some of them done. Where can you do that? You said it, market or higher. Tip number three, engagement rate versus click-through rate. You're probably already tracking your click-through rate, also called your CTR. Increasing your click-through rate from 0.5% to 0.75% has the potential to generate a lot more customers for you. But did you know that your CTR is actually less important than your engagement rate? Your engagement rate tracks what people do after they click on your link. Did they they instantly click back out from your landing page? If so, that's bad news. A high CTR with a low engagement rate won't generate the kind of results you're hoping for. But if you have a high engagement rate, for example, if people scroll down to the bottom of your page or click through to go deeper into your website, then that is likely to drive better results than a high CTR. Tip number four, use chatbots to engage prospects. You've seen plenty of chatbots on the websites that you visit, but did you know that they're actually very easy to install? A chatbot on one of my websites took about 10 minutes to get it working. So now when people visit that site, they're greeted with an automated response that keeps them engaged with my content. If they ask a question the chatbot can't answer, I'm alerted on my mobile device that someone wants to talk to me. The result is that they get the real me, not the automated chatbot me, in just a matter of minutes. Don't be afraid of the chatbot. Tip number five, focus on your existing customers. Did you know that it costs five times less to get an existing customer to buy again than it does to get a new customer to buy for the first time? That's right. If you spend $1 getting an existing customer to come back and buy from you again, it'll take $5 to get a new customer to buy from you the first time. Most people don't know that. So they spend a lot of their money trying to get first time customers. 
customers. Now, don't get me wrong. First time customers are an important part of your long term growth. But if you need a bump in revenue quickly, then the best and easiest place to get started is with existing customers. I'd like to thank Marketer Hire again for sponsoring this video. Try Marketer Hire today by using my link in the description below, marketerhire.com slash Jamie. If you like what you saw here today, give me a thumbs up or leave a comment below and click here for more videos like this one. My name is Jamie Turner. I'm an author, a professor, and a speaker at events around the globe. And I'll catch you next time.